everybody, this is uh, Keith and Joyce Garland. Um, we are not by any stretch of the imagination professional bloggers or vloggers, whatever it's called. We're not even amateur bloggers. Um, but we're going to try this thing out um, because of Welcome what we are doing or what we want to do. Um, we're going to set up a new uh, YouTube page, right? A new YouTube page. And we're going to call it K and J or J and K Road to Tokyo 2020. Today is uh, January 11th, 2020. We will be attending. Today is the 11th. All right. We'll do a lot of that in this vlog, blog, whatever it's called. It's the 10th. Uh, today is the 10th. Tomorrow's the 11th. Like I told you, Joyce. Anyway. <laughs> Um, we're going to do a ton of that, um, but we're going to be attending the uh, 2020 Olympics in Tokyo, Japan, and um, we have a ton of traveling to do leading up to that. Um, um, most importantly, following our son, Kyle Garland, who is uh, the athlete at the University of Georgia, and he has a chance to be a part of the Olympic team, so we're going to take our family and our friends and really ourselves. We're just doing it really so that uh, this journey can be recorded in perpetuity and um, you know we're going to just be following him along the road and um, along the road and hopefully he makes it. Um, he's a long shot to make it but uh, we're going to speak this thing into existence and and ride on with it and see where it's going to go. Today is our first of hopefully several uh, vlogs. We are currently uh, on uh, at the Philadelphia airport traveling to uh, Atlanta, Georgia, and then taking a car ride to uh, Clemson where he's going to be performing his first meet of the year. We're excited um, to always to see him run, but particularly today, uh, his first meet in a year, almost to the day, mm -hmm. um, last year, uh, where he hurt himself and was out for the entire year. Uh, he's back, he's bigger, better, stronger, and we're expecting uh, great things from him so we want all your tell all your friends about it if you see it I mean we'll probably have a subscription of about 30 with our family and friends but more importantly if people see this we want you to tell people about it because we want all your prayers all your positive thoughts all your good vibes all your your positive energy for Kyle Garland and um, we'll make sure we get him in a couple of these videos as well and um, worst case scenario um, we'll have this for our grandkids and his grandkids as we travel to Tokyo uh, for uh, a lifetime trip at the Olympics uh, and best case scenario we'll be traveling to Tokyo um, for the Olympics with Kyle in it so um, here's the first one and um, hopefully there's many more and hopefully it ends uh, with him giving an interview about making the team. All right, so I'm Kay, she's Jay, Jay. Um, and um, we're on our road to Tokyo. You're Jay, I'm Kay. Yeah, I'm, J I'm Jay, he's Kay. Uh, just <laughs> we're here in Atlanta, waiting on the shuttle to go get the rental car, um, going to our hotel for the night, going to get up early, <laughs> head down to Clemson tomorrow to go check out our boy and the and the dogs. Uh, on the road to Tokyo. Tokyo. Check in with you later.
got back from uh, the first meet uh, down in South Carolina. It was a really, really exciting meet. It was amazing. Most, most, the most exciting part was we just got to see Kyle uh, run again after being off for a year. Mm -hmm. um, that was super cool. Um, we were grateful for that. Um, he had some pre pre race jitters and stuff that kind of impacted his first race, but overall, I think he had a B B plus meet. Um, both he and his coach were really excited about it. Um, his, his first race was impacted. You could, it was obvious he had some nervous energy and whatnot, um, and he didn't run his best race, but still ran a really, really good time. So he was excited about that. I was excited about that. Um, and we actually think he'll gonna, he's going to build on that. Um, he was running against some of the best hurtlers in the country um, uh, for Florida and Clemson, and he's still at Florida State, and he still did very, very well. Um, but his pole vault was outstanding. Um, his pole vault is kind of the weakest of his 10 events, but it's obvious that he had been working really hard over the year, over the, over the fall. He had two PRs. He's floating right around 15 feet, which is outstanding for a multi. So we're just going to build on that and uh, hope that he can, he can get that 15 foot mark or better before the end of the year. Both he and his coach are confident that that's going to happen. So we're excited about that. Uh, leg one uh, on our road to Tokyo is down. Uh, we saw nothing to indicate that um, this journey <laughs> shouldn't continue, so we're excited about that. Um, our next stop uh, is in two weeks, right back at Clemson again. Um, we think he's going to do a couple different events, so we don't know exactly. We'll find out about that um, over the next week or so. Um, but we're still building. Um, the countdown, we're less than 180, 180 days away from Tokyo. Um, and we are excited about Kyle's prospects and about him hopefully joining us on that trip. Um, it's just going to be an exciting time. Thank you for your prayers and your, your thoughts and your good vibes. Continue to keep Kyle lifted up. Uh, we're going to keep you updated, um, show you most of his, or as, many, as many of his events as we can. Um, get him in on an interview or two over the next meet or two, and then we'll just see where we go from here. But uh, for now, Nothing's changed. Um, meet one is over. Stop one is over. On our road to Tokyo 2020. We'll see you next week. Thanks. Bye. See ya. Bye.